Hello, I'm Tyler Bland, and I'm a professor in the Whammy Medical Education Program. And today I want to show you how we are changing the landscape of the health sciences. Not through more lectures and textbooks, but by playing games with medical education. So most of us know Pokemon, those cute little characters you catch, train, and battle. They've inspired games, TV shows, entire childhoods. But what if they did something more? What if, instead of just battling for fun, they battled for knowledge? What if they could guide us through science and medicine, turning memorization into discovery? In other words, what if Pokemon went to medical school and brought you along for the ride? That's Medimon, a game where cells, organs, and even diseases come alive as collectible creatures. Each one is carefully designed with built-in mnemonics, little memory hooks, that help learners truly remember complex topics. Let's take our beta cell character here for a second. The eye spikes on his back, they represent insulin. And the donuts he's munching on, those symbolize how insulin helps cells absorb sugar for energy. Now let's take a look at the diseased version, type 1 diabetes. He's dying. His eye spikes are broken, and he's being attacked by bees, mnemonics for autoantibodies destroying beta cells. Suddenly, pancreas, physiology, and diseases aren't just something you memorize. It's something you see, feel, and remember. But creatures alone aren't enough. What if the game itself could talk back? Medimon incorporates AI-powered NPCs characters who can serve as tutors. So picture this. A student pauses mid-battle and asks their in-game guide, hey, how does insulin actually work? Right there, in the exact moment of curiosity, the NPC explains it. It's like having a professor in your pocket, only dressed as a game character. Imagine the engagement when ChatGPT meets Pokemon in a medical classroom. But why are we doing this? <laughs> Medical students often describe their education as drinking from a fire hose. There's just so much coming at them that they're not able to absorb it all. So what we're trying to do is flavor that fire hose with gamification, making it more palatable, more memorable, and frankly, more fun. And if you think back to your own high school health class, well, you might agree it could use a little flavoring, too. And here's the best part. It works. In our studies, Medimon increased high school students' knowledge by over 100%. Undergraduates, 23%. This means that students at multiple levels are not only just enjoying the game, they're learning more, remembering more, and applying more. And while the video game isn't yet live in our medical curriculum, our Medimon trading card game, yes, we have trading cards, has made its debut. And when surveyed, 75% of our medical students want us to expand it across our entire program. So think of it this way. The next generation of doctors isn't just ready for gamification, they're asking for it. So, with Medimon, you don't just play, you catch knowledge, you battle boredom, and you heal your mind. So join us on this quest and see if you can contract them all. <laughs> Thank you.